What's up guys, Georgia is here. So today we will do some modeling again. And um, yeah, for today we will make some a design about humidifier. Um, this design I got it from uh, Xiaomi or something like that. The brand I forget uh, if it's Xiaomi or so on, but I will show you on this. And um, yeah, it's kind of easy to make it something like that. And um, before continue to this tutorial video, feel free to subscribe. And if you want to join to be my patron, you can click link down below and also is there for uh, like a few of things that you can find it about modeling and so on about the tutorial video about a uh, materials and so on. So guys now um, here we are, uh, we have some cube. I'm gonna uh, delete all of this. And then here I will just be using some cylinder. In this cylinder, I'm gonna be using around not not so much. I think we'll be just using like 50 is kind of okay. So we'll be like that. I'm gonna uh, set it auto uh, auto smooth. And then after this, I want to uh, make it a little bit large like this. And then um I want to duplicate this. Just grab it down, and then uh, make it a little bit lower by clicking C and uh, S and then Z so just do it like this all right so if you already do that let's go click tab choosing this uh, head selection mode hold your alt so we'll be just following this one here and then control B we can do it like this all right understand but I think I want oops I want to make it like a little bit more uh, highest first we can do it like this just something like that I think it's kind of better and okay so here for a segment we can edit more into like something just a little bit like 29 something like this or maybe less than this okay so maybe in 20 all right in 20 kind of okay and then after this, I want to take it and grab it down. I'm um, gonna move it here. Gonna choosing this. And then grab it up here. That's cool. So after this, uh, something that I want to changing here. It's too, too big. So we can make sure that a little bit smaller. So now it's kind of looks better than before. All right, now let's go move down here. Uh, we will add some like hole for uh, smoke like or fog. It's going up from this uh, design object is here. So we we will uh, choosing like maybe here or maybe here. All right, here, in here. So hold your Alt and then hold your Shift also. So we can put it there. And um, we can add it also one and here and um, here. That's cool. Now go into this here. Individual origins. Double I. Make sure that it's small. We can grab it inside. So it will be looks like this. Or maybe we can edit more like this, more inside like that. Click tab and then I'm gonna delete this by faces. So we have the hole and the object that we want it. But here we want to add some rubber. So we can uh, duplicate for this one by clicking Shift D. And then we can grab it down a little bit. Click E and then click G to move it up here so we will having something interesting here all right so now we can add some bevel here add some bevel it's kind of yeah 20 and then here just take it down into uh, 0 0.01 this is the setting that I always uh, use it it's kind of good and doesn't look so bad here so we can using this one and then let's go move up here i'm gonna add some a bevel first here and then we'll be using also 20 and then here 
same as like before. Click tab, choosing this, click E, all right, and then click E again, and one more. So just do it like that, grab it by clicking G and then the Z, just grab it down like this. <clears throat> so we'll be having like that. And now, choosing this one, hold your Alt, click E, grab it by clicking G, and we have the object like this. It's kind of cool. Alright, so guys, now if you already have the object looks like this, we can go in into the uh, level brand again. We will be using text. And here, I'm gonna add just R max again my favorite brand so now uh, going to a geometry extrude this one just a little bit at least like three or four something like that and we can add some bevel here point one oops okay aha uh -huh. it's wrong so something like this and um, after that I'm gonna bring back all of this uh, cylinder we can rotate this one, but before that, I want to changing the font of this a level, and go to the font and here, Dubai. Uh, oops, Dubai Bolt. I will using this one. It's kind of good. Also, look at that. It's kind of be RX, and then we can rotate this one again. R. And then y minus 90 so we'll be like that or we can put like this 180 so we can put like this like this also but yeah we can put it in the front of this here like this oh yeah we can we can we can do it like this but oops this is not in the middle so we have to bring it back here and um, this is kind of too big so we can grab it down a little bit put it down here so we can put it there something like this Sip A uh, let's get at some icosphere this icosphere we will using for a light that we want to using here in the front of this one which is something like this just a little bit smaller okay something like this yeah that's cool and now um we can see the humidity uh the humidifier it's already uh looks like cool but we needed something changing here just a little bit a little bit something that we want to changing uh not changing but added something interesting here just some hole here we're using just a cylinder can go here and um, all right we need to using a single vertex grab it just something like this this one also here and make it smaller R Z90 grab it here to the middle it up set auto smooth we can put it there and um, click here boolean all right just grab it down here and click this one choosing this and apply and um, oops and um, one more we're gonna put it there or we can delete this like that but it's kind of not good enough so we will bring more um, boolean here and then we will choosing like this and then apply all right so now we have something a little bit uh, detail here and um, after that we can uh, edit something here also for our uh, level name here we can do uh, duplicate by clicking CD R Z and 90 oops R Y and 90 so something like that 
and then we can put it there we can put it down here so we can put it there that's cool and now um let's get at some a uh, empty we will using some a uh, cube we get a little bit uh more bigger something like this and um like that gonna choose all of that control p and then object keep transform Alright, so guys, now if you click on this um, empty, the object will be follow this one. So don't for, uh, don't worry about that. We have this humidifier done, but we have to do something a little bit more because this humid uh, this humidifier model didn't have some a material color. So we will go into the settings now, and I need some vertical split here. We can move here, and um, just wait a few second, and we can change in here we will using some serial editor all right so now click new in this one here just bring down the roughness a little bit uh something like this and bring up metallic a little bit like that Ctrl a add some color ram i'm gonna move it this color ram into the best color and then noise texture and then fact into the fact here and control T just bring here and then object into the vector let's go scale up this into and just bring this up into uh, 500 so will be looks like this and then after that we can changing the color a little bit here make it more uh, looks like white and so on but not looks like more white we can do a little bit like broken white something like this kind of cool and um, yeah we can click here and then this object and this one also here and this one and then this one here all right so control L and then link material and now the material will be follow the first one here right just easy like that but here we will using a different one we will using some a emission zip a emission all right and then connect this uh, emission into the surface um i think i want to do a little bit changing i want to make it uh, more a little bit like silver or something like that we can do it like this and um, yeah but I think this will uh, orange or red will be better so it will be looks like this all right so guys now I uh, all right so like this and um, yeah it's kind of cool and the design that we wanted it's done here and then uh, we can using uh scholar also uh, also all right so guys now uh tutorial for today it's done it's really easy to make it something like this and if you want to have all exactly like this you can join the my patreon link down below or you can have it on my gumroad and cg trader link down below and by the way don't forget to like comment and subscribe and share this video to people who wants to learn about blender and so on thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe georgia is here see you in the next video